Hey friends, it's Dimitri through Boschka Streetwear. So one of you asked me a question about how to ship hoodies. And once in a while, if I think that the question needs a video, I will make a video. So whoever asked this, here you go. So the question was, will a 12 by 15 poly mailer be a good way to ship a hoodie? And the answer is yes and no, and I'll explain why. So in this poly mailer right here, the 12 by 15 and a half inch one from Uline, you can ship small, medium, and large hoodies comfortably. They will fit in this and they will ship. That will cost you anywhere from around eight to 11-ish dollars, depending on wh where you ship it in the state. Obviously, if you ship it internationally, it's gonna cost more. If you wanna ship an extra large and a double XL, you're going to need like a 14 by 17 poly mailer, something around that size or even bigger, depending how many items in are in there. But if it's one hoodie, it'll fit in there. It will not fit in the 12 by 15 and a half poly mailer. It doesn't fit in there. Now, here's the other thing, the flat rate envelope. These are nine and a half by 12 and a half. These are really great. The reason why is because this costs $8.75 to ship. As of now, that's the price that I pay for that. These typically go up in price every year, but it's still a good deal. So this is around $10 plus to ship and this is $8.75. So in this one, what I do, this is something I changed over the year. I ship a small hoodie, a medium hoodie, and a large hoodie. All of those will fit in here. You might be wondering, how is that gonna fit in there? It's kind of like big. Well, what you have to do is you have to get the air out and you fold it in half like this like this, see all the air is out of there. And then you could easily slide it in here. Now I will say, this is not my favorite way to ship, but there is a really great pro to it. The pro is that this is gonna arrive to your customer in like two days, so that's really fast. This one will probably take about a week to arrive um, and it costs more. So if I needed to ship a small hoodie uh, or medium or large, I'd rather use this because it's cheaper and faster than this. The only thing I do not like is that you have to fold it in half and that kind of takes a while. This, these two, you literally slide the hoodie in. The reason why that's important is because if your business is getting bigger and larger, you, you kind of have to be aware of the time that you're putting into it because having to do all of this kind of takes more time rather than just sliding a you know, hoodie in one of these very easily. And also, um, you know, I'm sure if you spent four hours, you could like shove this into this mailer. I've, I've seen people do that, but uh, that is a total waste of time. You're gonna be spending all day trying to do that. Just put it in here in one, or in one of the bigger poly mailers. And then what you do from there is you have to make sure that you adjust your shipping cost uh, to make sense for that. So for instance, if you uh, are charging too low for your shipping price, you're gonna be losing money. So make sure that you figure out an appropriate shipping price where it can all balance out and you're not gonna be losing money on that. And I will make a video uh, more about how to charge shipping. That'll be a totally separate video. But this video is specifically about shipping hoodies. Anyways, I hope you guys like this video. Uh, let me know what you think in the comments down below and I'll catch you guys later. Thanks guys.